Uh, what are we planting? I don't actually know what we're planting. Uh, we do want to plant a fair bit of corn. It's corn. Uh, at some point. Yo, Flapjack, what's up, dude? How you been? Welcome back, man. Uh, we are going to be planting, like I said, a fair bit of corn uh, at some point. But obviously, we can't do that for a minute. You're good? Awesome. You're watching all the content. You're two weeks behind because of hunting season. Oh, man. I'll try to do better about posting stuff to YouTube, I swear. I got way behind working on Christmas lights. Uh, for both, actually. <laughs> what? 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 So, the Chris Bergen's Twitter account mm -hmm. created, like, the clip of the fire. Yeah. And Jared instantly replies back, hot. That's it. <laughs> like Just Jared hot. Eisman? Yeah. <laughs> Isaacman. Isaacman, yeah, there you go. <laughs> he just responds hot. <laughs> well, okay. Have you been watching the replays on Twitch? I got you. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's a rocket launch early tomorrow. Is there? Morning. Nice. I'm pretty. I think it's an R it's an RTLS too. I'm pretty sure. Ooh. Ooh. Gotta love those RTLS. I don't think there's actually any bales out here, but I'm going to go for a lap just to make sure, chat. Because the problem is, if I let the baler run into a bale, it's just going to cause cause problems, you know? But we're oh, not... ooh, ooh. What? What? <laughs> it's early tomorrow. Oh, yeah? Wednesday, My... November 30th at 2.39 a.m. Oh, I'll still be up tonight. Let's go. Watch it exactly. tonight. Right bed. Uh... I've never seen an oh, RTLS it's... at night. Yeah, RTLS. At night? Um, It's a Japan oh. thing. I'm here for an RTLS oh, at night. Oh, it's a privately developed... Wow. Privately developed satellite. And it's going to the moon. Interesting. But it must be really small seeing that the Falcon Eye is doing RTLS. Yeah. All right. So, oh, the being, train's here. Train make it back finally? Train's here. Okay. Do you know the trick about, like, getting it back before it, like, leaves? Yeah. Oh, okay. I guess it didn't work for you. I did it the first time, and then I did it again, but I tapped out right away because oh. the fire suppression flashed. Okay, so you've got two loads of compost. Speaking I of planting my window. Someone's mowing leaves next to me. Okay, so we cannot plant anything that I want to... I do want to plant grass, but that's those fields are covered in straw. So we can't do that right now. So I'm not going to worry about that. Um, as far as selling anything else, I don't think we have anything else to sell besides that compost that you're working on. I don't. I still don't understand why we have 1.4 million liters of lime. That seems like an awful lot to have in storage. <laughs> Just throw it out there. Uh, so lightning, like I was saying before, for chaff. Oh, you know what? Let me go check on all that stuff real quick. Because all that needs to keep moving too, you know? It is all set up on auto drive, but we'll just check it manually. Real fast. Uh, but we're getting, we're under a million chaff. And to keep the process going, we will need to chaff. Uh, at some point, so. Yeah. We will definitely need to do that. Wow. Well. Thank you, Carson. I, I'm glad I could attend your TED Talk. I'm just saying, though. You're not wrong, actually. Like. You're not wrong. No, you're not wrong at all. Not wrong. Uh, so what I'm thinking, chat. Uh, left basically was saying that um, he wants to see. Uh, he wants to see uh, 32 in corn. 
So I'm here for it. Chaff. Okay. No, for, for corn corn. We're going to plant 30 in corn for chaff. Okay. And then beyond that, I don't know what we're planting. Yeah. Dave, what's going on, man? Welcome in. How are you? Hashtag a water break. This water break is brought to you in part by Your event. By event on the star on the booster. <laughs> Forgot my sound was on. <laughs> That's <was> really loud. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> kind of scared me. I'm not gonna lie. That's the worst thing though. It's like sometimes I'll have Starbase open, Hang but on. it's in it. It's hidden behind something else. Okay. Yeah, I can hear you now. What's up? No, but like multiple Google tabs, you have Starbase on one of them. You yeah. open something, you forget to bring Starbase back up, and then a vent or something happens. Oh. Yeah, yeah. That is really loud. So chat, I need to put chat on all of these. This, these all need. Okay, we might automate that process because uh, they hold a. Oh, there's not that much chaff. There's only like eight hundred thousand chaff. So we have automation for that, though, don't we? Flabjack, <laughs> you're not wrong. Usually that does happen every time you come in. You're right. You're not wrong. We all know that pancakes are better. Nah, dude. But see, I'm not a big syrup guy, so I don't care about the waffles having like the... Plus, I have like childhood PTSD from, from waffle night in the house, okay? Oh, really? Yeah. Well, because there were so many oh, of us, yeah, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, I know what you're talking about. With, like, about. one waffle iron that, you know, by the time yeah. I was allowed to eat, it was, like, 9 o'clock at night. I just had to sit there and watch everybody else eat their waffles, you know? And everyone else is showering half asleep already. There were nine of us in our house for five years, you know? With one waffle iron chat, okay? <laughs> Not childhood trauma at all, I swear. <laughs> oh, wait. Never mind, yeah, it is. Uh, but I can laugh about it now. That's that's what makes it good, right? But I'm a pancake guy personally. Not enough waffles. That's true. There was not enough. You're right, actually. Not gonna lie, you're not wrong. Ooh. Okay, so. Really need to do this, but also need to just kind of fast time so we can go plant stuff, you know? The one thing we're not going to plant any of is soybeans, chat. We're not going to plant any soybeans, okay? Because, uh, why? <laughs> you know? So you think, so you know how uh, SLS destroyed its launch pad? Yeah. Kind of. Because it had more power than what they thought. Yeah. Uh, this is twice that thrust, by the way. Uh huh. Uh, it takes about six, it's like 16 and a half engines at 100% throttle. Yeah. To match. That's all. Holy cow. So if they did like 16 or 17 engines on this test at 100%, yeah. Mickey, you're going to plant one soybean? Okay. That's cool, bro. I like Appreciate this truck. it. Hey, you like that truck? Yeah. It's uh, they're different than the the new uh, Volvos. Volvos. I wish you could slide the fifth plate just a little bit forward on that one though. Can you not? With that trailer, no. With that trailer, it needs to go forward a little bit, but that's all right. It's all good. It's all gravy. Now, eventually, chat, this will get hauled up up north, but that's something we can definitely auto drive. So why haul it ourselves when we can auto drive it? You know, just saying we can actually auto drive this whole process. Carson set all of this up. Is it set? Is it, I thought I set up. Where'd you move these? Or wait, is it all still set up? <coughs> oh, wait. Yeah, it is. I think it be. Well, I uploaded my config file the other day. Oh. But it was actually the server config file at one time, and then I... You just changed it a little I bit? added a bunch of stuff up north and then up re-uploaded it, so... Is there fermenting? 
They're fermenting silos. Yeah. It's all there. Uh, load and unload. <laughs> pretty much, yeah. We need chaff, John. I know. Xbox Series S. I think we need to plant 32 in corn and chaff it. I should, what? Um, Hyperlight, I don't know how I'd get a kickback from anybody. Are you saying because, like, you bought it because of... Okay, I get what you're saying now. Never mind. Yeah, I don't I don't get a kickback from anybody for anything. Our early access, but, you know, that's okay. It's all good. I'm not, uh, I'm not worried about it, to be honest, you know? It is all good with me, but that's good. I'm glad you're getting an Xbox and stuff. That's awesome. GG's. How do you put auto drive in a game? You mean the config? So it actually goes in your save game. So go into your my games or documents my games farm sim twenty two. Why can't I scroll? I don't know. Say your save game that you're putting it in is save game number five. It doesn't whatever save game you want it in. And then you literally just double click that save game. And then just drop the auto drive config right inside there. It just literally goes in the, the zip for the, the actual uh, save. If that makes sense. Oh yeah, that's where it goes. It's a whole thing. You know what we need here, chat, right? The little dump trucks. No, this is way too many... Uh, Way too many leaders moving around here. Yeah, we definitely need chaff. I didn't realize that everything was so, like, so empty. Josh, what's up, man? How you doing? Not a PC, but it'll get you started. It'll just make you want a PC, that's all. No, you don't have to unzip it. No unzipping required. No unzip required. Not have to. My goodness, we'll pull a little slower. Come on. It is 250,000, by the way, chat. So it's not that it's slow, it's just a lot of leaders, you know? That's all. Just a whole lot of chaff if you think about it. That is all. Alright, up we go. Okay, um uh happen here. Happen here. Why did he stop himself right there? Why? I'm to go fix a brake fluid. That's probably a good thing to get fixed. Might be a good thing to get fixed. Uh, Bert and Mickey's running around up here too, but yes, yeah, so I, I was thinking I should probably come check again because there are some up here. But yeah. He's running around out here with the other trailer on the tractor. But yeah, we're good. There's actually two rows though here, so that's good. So that should be... Oh no, grab the bale. I forgot to turn the trailer on. So that should be our four four end rows that I put in. So hopefully now Buddy will just turn around and not have to back up. I think that was the issue before. The fact that he had to back up every time. I could be wrong. I don't know. But it's okay. We'll figure it out, chat. We'll figure it out eventually. Yeah, brake 
quite fluidly. That's probably not a good thing to have happen, right? When you, like, you know, hit the brakes and you can't stop. Never a good time. And by the way, notice the two outside rounds, how nice and clean everything is now. That it went and bailed it all again. But for a little bit, the corners maybe. It's a whole lot better, let's put it that way. It's really not worth doing, but at the same time, it's worth doing. Just saying. Flapjack, look at you with seven years, bro. Dang, man. That's a long time, dude. Seven whole years. Holy cow. That is a long time. Yeah. Just a bit. Been a long time. All right. So notice Buddy turned around up here, but I don't know if he had a bail in his in his bailer that was causing problems, but he turned around, so. I have been streaming a long time. Why did he just call me old? Jeez. January 20th is 10 years, chat. Been making content. Nice. Sure. Oh, gotcha. I played. Okay. I gotcha. So if you know you're getting one from work, then yeah, why would you? Why would you buy your own when you can just use the work one, right? Makes sense to me. I'm here for it. Definitely makes sense. Okay. Because once you get on PC farm some. You'll be like, dang, this is a different world. You know? You will you will be it's a different world. Console farm sims fun, don't get me wrong. But you know, GPS and just all the 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 mods and the uh big big maps, you know, 4X maps and it's great. All right, this dude's on his fourth, so he should be good here in a minute just to go back and forth as well. Shouldn't have to intervene with him anymore. Or intervene him. Just should be able to let him, let him, let him eat. And hopefully it's going to work where I don't have to constantly be, uh, yeah, the whole thing. All right, chat, three million bucks. That was compost money. Here for it. I am here for it, chat. I don't love that compost money. Kyle, you lost your old Twitch account. What happened? You just not find it anymore? Or like, that playing hide and go seek with you or something? Like, JK. JK. No, it happens. I know several people that have uh, had to get new Twitch accounts for one reason or another, a new phone or a uh, new, new tablet or who knows. Made a new account three years ago when you got a new phone. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. We're having issues back there. Oh, no, we're not, actually. Yeah, we might be having issues back there. I'm not sure. All right. These bales dropped off here. I got you, Hyperlight. I got you. Ah, uh, you know, to be honest, I think, okay, we're good there. Is that full? 
I think my, uh, I technically have a different Twitch account that I used to watch Twitch on back in the day, right? And uh, I don't know that I could log into that one anymore, to be honest with y'all. I kind of don't think that I can. Okay, so chat, the Baylor's... Oh, he, okay, he'll be done here in just a minute on his... Right? One, two, three, four. Okay, he's done on his outside passes now. So this guy's good to go. Just need to clean up those couple. But that's fine. Um, the Baylor's are basically just gonna bail now right they're just gonna do their thing um we have nothing else that we're going to be selling currently uh the sorghum is not far off actually but we'll we'll sit on that for right now oh i do want to get the sugar beets cut that's something i want to accomplish today chat so we need a tractor put front loader arms on which is going to be this this uh jcb i think this might be our only tractor that we have that we can do this with it'll take the front loader arms so we're gonna get set up to cut some sugar beets because this is something that we can do while we're fast diamond as well we can just kind of let it run to be honest oh yeah that's what we're going to be doing Oh, Arzen, let me go. Hit a brick wall there, dude. Yeah, I did. He's a brick. <laughs> uh, you want to find like auger wagons and get them filmed with sugar beets, Carson? Or at? Uh, at the homestead. Right. Uh, 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 like auger wagons or like sugar beet auger wagons? Uh, real auger wagons. Seems legit. Oh, you know it. We can use sugar beet auger wagons if you really want. But uh, no. Doesn't matter. Where do you want them at? Uh, they're going to the sugar factory eventually. Okay. Sorry, Flapjack, but you're not the only one. You're not. What? Saying. I don't know why this is broken, too, by the way. It looks like a weird barcode. For other people, other people don't see it, but I sure do. Oh, yeah, it's fun. All right, and then just to help us out in their chat a little bit, just to help us out, that's a lot of chicken emotes. Uh, we're gonna grab, I still got, it's still stuck in my head. We're gonna grab a conveyor. A little, little stacker conveyor, do dead. Take that over with us. Get this all set up. I feel like today is maintenance day on the server. Y'all notice this? We're all we're just doing a bunch of like odd jobs right now, just kind of stuff that needs to happen, but just hasn't been happening lately, but needs to happen. That's all right. It's all stuff that needs to be done. I feel like that's kind of what the day streams usually are, like. Just doing a bunch of the cleanup work and stuff. There's nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with it. Oh, Tomb Tractor, why, why, why we gotta go with the cleanup song now? Oh no. Where's these cars rolling? What? Where are these cars go? To the sugar factory? Over where I'm going right now. What's wrong with those wheels? What wheels? The little uh, blockers on them. Oh, you talking about yeah, the ones on the conveyor? Yeah, uh, it's so technically this is known as a stacker conveyor. At least it that's what the I... way. Huh? It just clears the way of the wheel. Yeah. What time? It is 2.11 right now for me. 
So this is known as a stacker conveyor. And most people don't know this about this conveyor, but we'll, I'll show you what it does. Give me a second. I'll show you. Most people, I would say, don't realize that this conveyor can do this at all. But it totally can. And it's actually kind of cool. Right, so we're going to drop that off there. Then we're going to back it up. What? What? The fire X suppression system's back on. Are they about to static fire again? I don't know. Well, they look like wheel tracks. Yeah, you're gonna go to the other side first, like in front of me. I was driving, then I noticed that. What the heck? Unless there's a fire up under the skirt of the booster. I would hope not. But anyway, this thing's a stacker, right? Because these wheels turn. And then you actually... You can hire this thing. So I'm not doing this right now, chat, right? Okay, you can set its... Basically, its degree of how far it'll move back and forth, right? And then... You hire it so it'll make a pile. It'll stack back and forth. So this is doing this automatically. I'm not touching it. So yeah. It's kind of cool actually, not gonna lie. But that's that's most people don't realize that about this. It, no, it's base game. So, another static fire win. Uh, they're probably just testing it. Putting up the line or they're like putting something out under it. Emptying a system. Or there could, there could be a leak too and it's just drizzling out like methane or something. Oh. Could be. All right, so basically you get what's going on here, right? You want the pipe out now or? Yeah, go ahead. Let her rip. That's fancy. Last time we did this, we used a mother, bit, but. I don't really think we need to use a mother bin. We could just go right into the, the thing. Oh, it's off. That was weird. Is that not? Okay, hold up here. Ah. Okay, I think that's working. We're getting cut beats, right? So the reason to cut the beats chat, by the way, uh, is because cut beats are a, a one to one on the process of sugar making. It, it's it, you lose a hundred every time with regular, but it's a one to one. Just saying. So, uh, somebody probably needs to sit in the JCB though. I guess once we get it. Yeah, the JCB is moving, so. Somebody wants to yeah, sit in there and drive forward once in a while, I guess, because it's totally moving. Farms and physics, Chad. I love them. We get some wheel chocks. And dude, this, this dude. Chalk, bro. This dude just standing here like, this is the coolest thing I've ever seen. Bro, is that how they cut beats IRL? I have no idea. 
I have no clue about how they cut beats in real life. Not a clue, chat. But what I do know is I'll bring another uh, auger wagon. What do we have? Like a million liters of beets? Yeah. And 900,000 left? Yeah. So, a bit of a process here, chat, you know? Yeah. Is it pretty much? Okay. I uh, I grew up uh, and live in Missouri. We don't have sugar beets here. Dad apparently grew some at the farm one year, and they like didn't know what to do with them, so they fed them to the hogs. Nice. And once the hogs figured out like they tasted good, they were all about them. At first, they just kind of looked at them. So, yeah. Kind of interesting. Thank you, Bert. Like, talk about slow driving. Oh. Okay, it happens. Bailers are still bailing. That's the important thing. Bailers are still bailing. Let those guys run. In it. That's really, really for hog food. Gotcha. Yeah, we don't, we don't get any. Basically, if it's not corn or soybeans or a little bit of wheat, that's that's pretty much all we grow around here. Around these parts. Now, if you drive like 30 minutes away, pretty much in any direction from where I live, you'll start seeing cows and, you know, a few pigs and stuff like that. But where I'm at and like where the farm is that I always talk about, there's no animals down there. There's two guys that have a few cows each, mostly for like, I think they have kids that are in 4-H. Like, that's about it, you know? Couple people have chickens. But for the most part, it's just corn and beans. That's pretty much it, y'all. Pretty much. Corn and beans. Eddie, what's up? How you doing? Welcome in. And I know you would not haul sugar beets in an auger wagon IRL, at least, you know, like a conveyor wagon. Sure, not an auger, I know. But you know what, Chad? It works. All right. It works. Therefore, I'm going to do it. Nobody can stop me. Just saying. Oh, this host homestead is so much cleaner now that I've like remodeled I'm here for it. Wait, there's 400 and why is there any chaff here? Huh? 450,000 liters of chaff in the homestead. Interesting. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Yeah. Uh, if you're wanting to join, come in our team speak and get to know us off stream. That is how you join. This server is only for the trusted folks. Anybody can become one of the trusted folks, though. Not hard to do. It just takes a little time when I'm not streaming. Come in and hang out and get to know us. I'll be in tonight off stream, actually. There you go, Bert. Yeah. Yep, that's that's about it, right? I don't know about where you're where you guys are at, Bert, but uh, you know where we're at, it's floodplain too. So people are absolutely like, no, we don't want we don't want critters where it's a floodplain. You know, not a good idea. Some people don't get it. Well, they're 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 silly. Uh, we do have a Discord, exclamation point Discord, but we don't hang out and, like, actually talk in there. Like, you know, we talk in TeamSpeak. 
And that's where, if you want to actually join the servers, you got to come in and talk to us, talk to us in our team speak. I know that it's like the old way of the internet and all that stuff. I know. Nobody uses TeamSpeak anymore. I'm aware. But somebody else must because they keep servers running, you know? So somebody's using it besides me. Can't be the only one. But yeah. We, uh, we just prefer, prefer the TeamSpeak. And like I said, I will be here. Oh, Carson, you cheated, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I will be around uh, my team speak tonight off stream. After I have some dinner. I'll be around. Yeah, last time we actually put a mother bin down here. Build that sucker mm. up. Let her run. Let it eat. The That's John Deere 8RX is getting moved though before I leave. What is it? Scooting too? Pat, it's you kind of have to strong farmer your auger wagon into where it's at. No. Thanks for the uh, follow there. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? Welcome, welcome. In fact, I think I talked last time about using multiple conveyor belts to get like out to the road. So we didn't have to yeah. come, come in all the way in here, you know? But that's okay. Ask you to watch some vids on the YouTube. Nice. Welcome in. You can also shorten that auger up if that would help. Or that conveyor. Doesn't have to be that. Oh, nope. Okay. You'll probably have to come in, like pull all the way in. No, just like the auger, then back in. No, just like I am right now. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? Welcome in, everybody. We are currently cutting some sugar beets, y'all. Not something you see every day, but we're doing it yet. We're here for it. I had about a million, you know? Only had about a million. Not bad. Armin, you know it. Chad, it is getting hot in this room, by the way. It is getting, it's getting warm in my room too. Well, you see, I should have turned my air on before I started streaming, but I was like, oh, it's nice in here. I don't need to do that. Big mistake, chat. Big mistake. It's 62 outside, but with the computers on and stuff, it gets warm in here. So yeah. I got tornado warnings down south right now. It's 71 and breezy. Yeah, too breezy, no inflatables around today. Exactly. You know, I put that 20 foot tall inflatable sand out there. I don't know if he's ever going to be on this winter. Yeah. Yesterday was like probably the the highest wind that I'll allow my inflatables to be on. Pretty warm there today, Clamjack. Nice. I actually told Dad, I was like, I need to get a weather station. He's like, What? I was like, Yeah, so I can know what the wind's going to be. He's like, Just stick your head out the door. Like, Go outside. I was like, but you should you should have been like, dude, are you telling me to touch grass? How dare you? That's them fighting words right there, you know? When I was gone, I would I would I would be like I'd ask people here be like, hey, how's the weather there? <laughs> be like, is it windy? Problem is people's perception of wind and like how windy it actually is are different, you know? Yeah. No, I'd be like, go outside and send me a video of your tree. <laughs> Or like the person I asked, like two people across the street both have flags up. Oh yeah. Like, okay, send me a video of the tree and then the flag. Yeah, what's the flag look like? How's the flag today? Is yeah. it wet? Then it's raining. You can't see it. Probably a tornado. It's underwater. We've got other issues. Twenty eight feels but, like fifteen with flurries. Oh boy. That sounds like fun. Yeah. Where I'm from in Nebraska. When I left for a class this morning, yeah, I got a snap from someone there, and it, it snowed. And there was a, it was 18 degrees. Oh wow! I'm like, Whew, it is sunny and 55. Don't miss <laughs> that. Yep. And now it's 71. Get a windsock. 
like a full on like landing pad, helipad like setup with yeah. the windsock and the lights on the four sides, right? Yeah. Now my neighbor does have a flag over here and like obviously if the flag's like blown too much, I'm uh, no. I'm good. Like that that doesn't interest me at all. I'm I'm not trying to ruin the new Did inflatable. Did you see me coming and close your tarp? No. Huh? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> What's it to you? That, I don't even think I could get. I wasn't sure. I was like, I'm not gonna risk it for the biscuit here. I would you have know? to like either back over the cars off my left front track, or like back into the right of you, <laughs> and Sean Farmer the car up onto the, like the walkway in the building. Kansas Nebraska border. I've been there to like the eastern part of the border, kind of. You know. Lol. Why? Yeah. What? We replaced the flighting on these auger wagons recently. No. Uh-oh. Farmer's out. Okay. All right. Why is it all the dad jokes today, huh? What's up with all the dad jokes? I mean, they're funny, but man. Why I closed my tarp? Because I just didn't want Carson to get any ideas of trying to, like, fill up my... My tratter, you know, with his his auger wagon, my auger wagon with his, you know, I was just let me empty out, you know. That was my thing. That's all. That is all. Just thought of this. Not sure how it's gonna go. What? And the RPMs on that John Deere are all over the place, Carson. Which one? The uh, 8R or 9R. Do I know why dad jokes are called dad jokes? Because they're a parent. Right? Pretty sure, because they're a parent. Are you bringing this other stuff over here? What are you doing? I didn't know because you like tabbed away. Where'd you go? Yeah. I'm over at the fermenter side. Oh, yeah, okay. Never mind. Well, what happened, Mickey? Okay. That bucket is incredibly slow, and I know if Plugger was here right now, he would tell me. That he sent, he has sent me a wagon that'll cut the beats way faster. I have it somewhere. You know, I don't have it on the server. This is fine. Do I want a riddle? No. Do I? I don't think so. Amazon, I didn't order anything from you. Did I? I don't remember. Oh, something's getting delivered today, Carson. Oh, really? Ooh, ooh boy. Yeah. I uh, decided to upgrade some lighting in my house. Oh, those. Oh. With motion sensors because I'm you tired of about it people yeah. leaving That's lights fine. on. Yeah. one time wow wow that tractor like keeps moving like big time that darn uh darn jcb over there just keeps on moving chat arms and physics you know we don't have any just saying all right Go ahead. Move this one up. We'll go get filled up. Kind of forgot we had this tractor, by the way. This was a, a Leonard was in here and he goes, hey, it's on sale. And I was like, all right, whatever. And then it, boom, magically we have it now. Amazing how that works, isn't it? 
And I didn't care. They had the money, kind of. Not really, but kind of. What's all good? And yes, we could pay off our loan right now, chat, but seed and fertilizer costs are going to be pretty high for us. So. The farming riddle. Okay. Let's hear it. I gave him permission for it. It's okay. Oh, man. We should... I don't... We're not really going to have anything else to sell between now and planting season, I don't think. So I don't know that we can pay the loan right now. We'll have $120,000, which isn't bad. But I don't know that we're selling anything between now and then. Uh, I'll have to look, Mickey. I, I haven't looked lately. I guess I'll have to look, yeah. You got a truck coming to get that chaff, person? Do what? You got a truck coming over here to get chaff or what? Yeah. yeah. I just don't know why there's chaff here. Oh my goodness, learn how to drive, John. Jeez. My I've got day. all the um, silage unloaded too. Nice. Except for one. Nice. My first day. And all uh, the chaff's getting dumped into one too because we've got like none. Well, cow. I know. Maybe you were right, Bert. Okay. Um. What was I gonna say? The sugar, yeah. There's, there's also bulk sugar. We haul sugar bulk, but for some reason, even if you want it bulk, it still gives you pallets. So usually we just leave the pallets, and then just haul in bulk too. But we'll, we'll, I'll check it out here in a minute. If we can clean it all up, like, I'm here for that, too. Oh, so, yeah. I think there's an airplane, maybe. Needs to fly? I don't know. I don't, I don't know that riddle. All I know, Chad, is I'm counting down the minutes to break time, and then I can go turn... My air conditioning on. <laughs> oh, I can't wait. Hot in here, chat. All right. So, uh, let's stick to the dad jokes, maybe, not riddles. Whenever I think of a riddle, I think of Sea of Thieves, and I just get, like, angry. Black flashbacks to how dumb I am at like take 14 paces and and you know I'm saying all those stupid riddles in that game you know yeah I get angry just like I'm too dumb for this dude why did he what gotcha Bert I get it am I supposed to laugh Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? Sheep laugh for you. Cool. Oh, come on, Bessie. You can do it. All right. Here we go. He hurt. Okay. Okay. All right, Joe. Um, let's look at our sugar. Sugar, sugar. So sugar sells in like September. Generally speaking, for like fifteen ninety. 
I mean, we have a we have lots of fifteen hundred prices right now. We have seventeen at the train right now. I say we send that to the train chat, right? Uh, that's not an accurate number, of course, because we don't have any in storage. But I say we that's worth that's worth eighteen is the max price this is saying, but it's worth seventeen right now. So I say we send it. I don't, how much is there actually? Oh, well, there's, uh, there's none. What happened to our sugar? Have we just not had any in forever? Maybe that's what it is. Never mind. We don't have any sugar to sell. We have those few pallets, but I'm not worried about that, honestly. Uh, Mr. Plugger, good afternoon. How we doing? I'm not worried about the pallets, Mickey. It's fine. That's not that much. Besides, they'll just respawn, so. Let's just leave them. How's it going, Plugger? Welcome in. Hope all is well. So, chat, we are currently cutting some sugar beets. I don't know how many of this, how many of these will actually do. We probably won't do them all right now. But at least our sugar factory is going up, up and running again. That's really what I was after. Um, I think, and we'll kind of mess with this till break time. About 20 more minutes. And then, after break time, we're going to fast time. And uh, either do some selling over the winter or fast times so we can like start planting our corn that we want. Corn and whatever else we're going to plant. I don't know yet. Definitely some corn. Because we need chaff. And we actually want chaff too. Or we want just corn, corn. Yeah, we should probably go check balers too. You're right. It's corn. All right. All right. Put this guy right here. Let him go. Let's go check our balers. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, buddy. Probably can get a bail trailer going. What about Carson? What? Oh. But I didn't say anything. Oh, you did. Not bad. My microphone fader is down. Okay. You can't. Yeah. Couldn't say anything if you wanted to, right? Yeah, I mean. One bail was in the way, chat. All right, that's good enough. Like I said, I'm probably gonna end up bailing all of this twice, to be completely honest with everybody. Which I know seems very counterproductive, but it's probably going to happen, okay? Just because. All right, so chat. Uh, this is on the pickup and deliver setting <laughs> for this. We're gonna go. We're gonna go ahead and set one of these up, at least one. Uh, so that's number two in there. Number two, and we're gonna unload this up here. We don't want to take this down to uh, the main farm because why? There's no point in doing that at all. And then we want to unload. Okay, that should work. Then that should work. We're gonna activate that button with that button. And you guys were talking about wizard like wizard things earlier with course play at auto drive. For those of you that haven't seen this, this is about to be automated bail picking. It's the final countdown. Put it in you. Put it in 
Uh, this is about to be automated bale picking up and hauling and delivering and coming back and getting more bales. That's what this is about to be, okay? Just saying. You haven't used it yet? Tricks. It's pretty awesome, not gonna lie. So there you go. So it just switched from auto drive to course play, which is why it repaired everything, because course play does that. I think it's a setting, but I'm cool with it. And then he's gonna come out here and just pick up bales automatically. I'm not doing this right now, chat. There you go. He's gonna pick bales and strap them down and away he goes. This is a pretty awesome, uh, pretty awesome thing to do here. Not gonna lie. Yeah, it's an auto load trailer. Uh, the the thing that you have to have. For this to work tricks is you have to have one of those trailers where you can select left right or behind not one of those trailers where you use your mouse to move the bales does that make sense it has to be one of those where you can choose and then you come into your um your settings here and you tell it to unload behind or left or right or whatever the only thing is I'm going to have to ride with him just to make sure uh, that he's going to unload because I've never unloaded at these bins up here. Uh, bales. Never unloaded bales up here before. So we're going to we're going to ride with it just to make sure it's going to work. That's what this trailer's in, I believe. Yeah. Yeah, but those ones where you can, like, move your mouse, like our semi-trailers, you can move the bales with your mouse, those don't work. So that it's something to, uh, something to keep in mind. And then a lot of times on this trailer, you're not going to quite get full trailer loads. Oh, actually, it looks like he's going to try. Or no, he's going to go three high. Okay, uh, because the it unstraps the bales every time it picks one up. And so sometimes they're not stacked perfect. And when they're not quite perfect, see like right there, when they're not quite perfect, sometimes it just won't put a bale there, uh, which not really a huge deal uh, if you get full loads or not. Cause you know, the whole thing about course playing auto drive, at least to me is the old set it and forget it. So I don't really care how long this takes to run out here. Just get the job done. Okay, and that's a visual glitch, obviously. That's a that's a server issue. A visual thing on a the server. They'll catch up to us eventually. But yeah. So not really a big not really a big deal. It might catch up right here. Nope, need to be unloaded. Okay, so now he's gonna switch back to auto drive. I still need to put that lap around this field. I still haven't done that. Need to do that, but oh, good. Now, I haven't tried the uh, wrapping of bales. You can wrap bales with horse play. I haven't tried that one yet. I haven't made silage bales in a while or haylage bales in forever, so I haven't done that yet. But someday, someday we'll do that again. Just right now, we if we want uh, silage, we chaffed. Not a big deal. All right, so he's looking for auto drive. He's gonna get on an auto drive path here in a second. He's gonna turn around. He's on auto drive, and he's gonna run up to our north bend. At least that's the hope. Hopefully, it all works. All right, how are our guys doing? On our TMR. 766,000. Let's go. We're getting there. It's fancy. Yeah, a little bit. Oh, this is why I bail so much, though. Is because I can automate the pickup and delivery process of the bales. I don't have to do it myself. Can I? Sure. 
I have a semi trailer that hauls like 30, whatever, 38 bales or whatever. I can do it, but right now in this configuration, I'm moving 135,000 uh, straw. So that's bigger than a loading wagon. Unless you go modded, of course. And yes, this is a modded trailer, but it's pretty cool. I think it's pretty neat, personally. I, I like this part. Of course, again, I like bailing, so kind of all makes sense, right? I do need to fix this road up here, but that'll happen eventually. Too worried about it right now. I see climb the hill. Come on, you're a 1050. You can do it, buddy. All right, now hopefully we don't have any issues here with our little guys that we have running around to. We should be okay. Yeah, exactly, Bear. Exactly. Yeah, I can be, you know, we're working on cutting sugar beets. Once I make sure this is working, then I'll, I'll go work on something else, you know. Go back to hauling sugar beets for a little bit. And that is the beauty of it, though. I think I'm going to have to move that point, though. Oh, it took them all. Okay. We're good. We are good. Now watch if one of those little cars is behind us and it puts them on top there. Oh, goodness. All right. Now he's going to run back to the field and uh, we'll pick up some more bales for us. Uh, where are we looking? Over here. There we go. Like, I don't know where stuff is. Run out of beats over here, chat. Got the beats. Yeah, we got the beats. Yes, tricks. It does take a special silo to take bales. Not all of them will. This that's just, that's the one that comes with the map. That is a Stevie one. They come. It gives you a couple different ones. Uh, but that is one. One of them that takes bales. Yes. Live Jack. I'm sorry. I'm just, I'm just hitting all the dingers today. <laughs> all right. It happens, man, you know? I assume he has the same, the same ones there, uh, tricks. Yeah. I would assume it's the same, um, the same silos. Yeah. This is head. This should be. He just needs to be filled. Get out of here. Be gone. More sugar beets. He's about to run out over there, so we gotta hurry up. Yeah, saying. Come on. All right. Yeah, I think we'll just, uh, we'll mess, like I said, mess with this till break time and then, uh, do some fast time and do some seeding today. Just try to get some corn in the ground, maybe. Stuff like that, you know? I don't want to plant all of our fields in the same crop, I will tell you that much. I do like the, I don't want the shotgun approach, you know, of planting like different stuff. You know, I, I like that. I prefer that to be honest. So we definitely did a lot of soy, soy, soybeans, uh, just for, uh, trying to make that money so we can actually pay our loan and buy our cows. Those are the two big things. And then I guess once we got our cows all situated, uh, I'm thinking that pigs might be next. I don't know if we're going to have like horses and sheep and stuff too, but I think, I think if we do cows and pigs, we'll be pretty, pretty chill in there. You know, chat. 
Definitely cows. And we'll have to automate the milk hauling process as well. Because why not? Definitely here for that. Starting to get windy out there, Chad. I just heard my garage door rattle a little bit. That's when you know it's starting to get windy. I don't think any of my inflatables would be up today. Definitely not the big Santa Claus. That's not happening. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? Hey, it's Sarge. Hi, Sarge. Howdy. How you doing? I'm good. Awesome. Ended up with over 4 million soybeans, Sarge. Nice. Yep. Uh, Lagerbert, hello. Welcome in. How, how are you doing? Welcome on in. Bumblemeister, you're here for the pigs. Well, I will say you might have to be patient for a couple weeks, but we'll get them. You know, at least a week. So, yeah. Time to stock up. Great money and beans. You know it, Bert. All right. So, Sarge, we are currently uh, cutting a few sugar beets. I don't know that we're going to work on all of them because a bit of a lengthy process. But I was going to work on it until I take my break. And then uh, when I come back, we're going to do some fast time and, and do some uh, plant. Then <laughs> you'll be here for a couple of weeks. Gotcha. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? Welcome on in. Oh, that. Yeah, the alleyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tricks, you're not wrong, man. I am stuck. Okay. Come on, Bessie. Yeah, the grain cart, uh, grain cart and tractor might be a little big for that alleyway there, right? It happens. It definitely happens. Let's see, if we're looking at our crop calendar here, if we go to April, we can plant, you know, anything that we want, basically. So that's probably what we'll do. Definitely plant some corn. Maybe we plant some sunflowers. The only thing I don't want to plant is, is, is uh, soybeans. Since we just harvested like everything we own in soybeans. Took us over, it was over three streams, chat, to harvest all that. Plus, I worked on it last night for like three hours after stream, so. Four hours, whatever it was. It was the whole thing. Some virtual farmers make more than real farmers. Well, you can uh, you can play an entire year of farm sim in you know like a day if you wanted to of real life time. So yeah, you can make more in uh, farm sim than you can in real life. Absolutely, I would agree with that. And we do. <laughs> we definitely make more in here than uh, a lot of farmers I know in real life. That's for sure. Even if we're playing a map, you know, for a couple months, when we when we end, how much money we end up accumulating, we definitely make more in here than real farmers. Yes, but it's pretend money. It's not real money, so it doesn't matter. Just saying. Although you know, in in my opinion, and this is maybe contrary to popular belief. But uh, it's not all about money. You mean real money, too. Gotcha. Yeah, I, uh, I've i always had the mentality of like, you know, it's not all about the dollar dollar bill. There are some people that are like, oh, it's been, you know, 
so many minutes since a sub time to end my stream because you guys aren't supporting it's like really just go away not about that definitely not about that the people that want to sub or want to give bits or whatever they're going to do what they want to do and if other people can't or don't want to or whatever that's totally fine it doesn't uh doesn't bother me either way you know like obviously i appreciate the support that people do give in this channel people are very generous don't get me wrong but it's not required you know and okay, and trust so me do i start what do you need me to do uh run one of these auger wagons or take over running auger wagons for me over here at the sugar factory because i'm about to go take my break and then we'll have real work when I get back, you know? <laughs> I'll have real this work. It's just coming from the homestead, right? Yep, you betcha. Smithicles cheered X1000. Yes, indeed. We all have choices how we support streamers. Smitty, thank you for the thousand bits. I appreciate it, man. Thank you, thank you. But, you know, some streamers literally have, like, a countdown clock. If John Mo no superhero, no, 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 no. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm very blessed and very grateful for what I do have, uh, and and you know the support that I do get from streaming and stuff. But it's not all about that, you know. It's not all about the dollar bill at the end of the day in life in general, in my opinion. I think Mickey needs to move up, doesn't he? For some reason, oh, we need to turn it back on. L3FT4D3 at Cheerdex 100. How about that big grumble in Texas? Oh, left. Yeah, that was crazy. Thanks for the bits left. Uh, Mickey needs to turn on his beat cutter. Turn on me. I don't know if he's here right now. <laughs> he would just buy more Alice dollars. You're not wrong, Flapjack. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you're not wrong, Flapjack. Not at all. It's, it's just not on, is it, Sarge? Nope. Thinking he stepped away or fell asleep. The problem we were having is that JCB is moving. Ah. And so, I was like, you know, somebody needs to sit in it. But he's just too far back now. And it must be like, yeah, it's a whole thing. The whole thing. Alright, so maybe I'll just go take my break. It is 3 o'clock anyway. That's what we'll do. We'll go take a break, and then, uh... You know what? Let's go ride with one of our little uh, guys up north here. You know what, let's ride. Where's the bail picker guy at? Let's ride with him. Where's he at? With this guy? This guy. There we go, chat. We'll watch some bails. Uh, but yes, I would just buy more Alice Chalmers. You're not wrong. Mary, what's going on? Welcome in. How are you? L3FT4D3 at Cheerdex 100. Money may not buy happiness, but a wise man said it sure helps. Kick Mickey in the shin. He isn't working. That's aggressive. Oh. You're going to do sugar cane for the first time and too lazy. I got you. Actually, we're like, I'm going to do plant some sugar cane at some point too. Not going to lie. We have the harvester. We have a big harvester. Jeff, what's going on? Welcome in. All right, Sarge, I'll be back in a minute. All righty. All right, chat. I am going to take, oh man, it's been been so long since I've been able to say this. Y'all ready for this? Chat? Chat. Oh, buddy. Get out of the way of the tractor. What are you doing? Get out of the way of the bailer. Ah! <laughs> Almost a midfield collision. Doing better. I'm glad to hear you're getting better there, uh. Uh, Mary, it's unfortunate getting sick and stuff. You know, it's never fun. 
have our fun. But chat, it is three o'clock. I'm going to take a holy cow, it's been so long. I haven't said this in like five weeks. I'm gonna take my three o'clock break, chat. I will be back in a matter of minutes.